Hello and welcome to Civilization V, <laughs> the era of Marky Moo. So yeah, um, I found a mod for Civ, and it was Markiplier. I couldn't resist but playing Markiplier. I mean, the thing, the paragraph states that you know it's Markiplier. He's the world's greatest YouTuber, and he is. I agree, one of the kindest too. He's done so much for charities. It's ridiculous. He's like my ins him and Jacksepticeye are like my inspiration to why I wanted to do a YouTube channel. I love my video games, so why not? <clears throat> so yes, and if you can see, I am teamed up with Tony Stark, Iron Man, because Markiplier and Tony Stark. I don't know. It just seemed to fit really well. <laughs> I mean, it is ridiculous. I do play with mods because. Civ mods are fantastic. Mostly, I just like other civilizations to choose from. Not really fiddle around deep into the mods, except I do have, uh, <laughs> I believe it's on here too, Pokemon religion, because why not? <coughs> you can't go wrong with Pokemon and believing in those things, right? Yeah. <coughs> I mean, we just started, very beginning, so right now we are made our first settlement. We are wandering around for relics to find because artifacts and relics are fantastic. And there's a city-state over there. Don't know what it is yet because we haven't fully said hi. But you know, that's fantastic. Learning pottery off break. Good start, good start. Um, with the, When you go to choose the next thing to get out of your town, right now I'm working on uh, things are called Marky Moos. <laughs> which are cheaper than actual workers and they work a little bit faster than normal workers so Marky Moves are great <laughs> Marky Moves are fantastic and he's really he really works on culture getting a lot of culture getting great people out it's really good that's what you want because <clears throat> I'm gonna try to do a diplomatic victory just because Games like these, I'm not entirely Jump the best at. I'm not that good at them. But if I can win by buying all the city states and having all the delegates and having them just vote for everything of me that I want, then fine. That's fantastic. <clears throat> I will go the diplomatic route. And I've spent like <laughs> Steam has told me I spent like 52 hours on this game. I can't help it. You just start up Civ, and then you just, oh, I'll click next turn, next turn, I'll stop, next turn, I'll stop, next turn, I'll stop. Oh, that's stuff for this guy. Oh, hooray. <clears throat> yeah, um, my wish list is pretty long. <laughs> I want a lot of, a lot of games, I do, but, like, I want to say 40% of them, my laptop can't even, like, remotely try to run. Because I tried to get it to run No Man's Sky. Yeah, no, that didn't work. Not at all. Oh, yay, Marky Moos are done. Hey, make a farm here, because we need farms. Marky Moos are great. <clears throat> nice, cheap dudes. But we want that recording studio, so it'll... <clears throat> so every town you make has a recording studio. I don't remember what it replaces. I think it's monuments that it replaces, because I don't see monuments everywhere. Also, the music is fantastic, if you didn't hear in the beginning the era of Marky Moo. The music of Marky Moo. You must have the music of Marky Moo. <laughs> and I love that this civilization, it's called Markiplier, but in parentheses, it's Marky Moo magic. Okay. <laughs> we'll go with that. Everyone loves M Markiplier magic, right? Yeah. <laughs> it sounds weird. Oh, it sounds so weird. Alright, which way are we going? Do I want to poop out more dudes? Or do more traditional things. Mm. Mm, yeah. If I can have that happiness go up quicker first, that'd be great. Cause somehow I always mess this up where, like, after, like, turn 70 or so, my people are, like, super unhappy with me and they just start uh, rebelling. Usually by then, by then I have, you know, armed forces out. A little bit, like, two or three dudes, but enough to take care of the rebellion. But I always have a rebellion going on. So, I'm starting to learn, keep them happy. I don't have rebels on my hand. Turn off barbarians, so I'm not annoyed and hate this game. I hate barbarians. I just, I'd rather find relics than barbarians. 
I, I get barbarians are supposed to be there to be barbarians and whatever they do. But no. <clears throat> I'm already having problems with my people rebelling against me. I don't need barbarians jumping in the mix. <laughs> I'm, I'm so terrible at this game. <laughs> but I want to find more things. Iron Man's ahead of me. I mean, we're on the same team, so it doesn't matter. But, excuse me. Yay. Sound another wonder. Sweet. More happiness, more wonders. That's, that's what I want. Hurry up with them horses, though. Ormus. Yay, another city-state. Sweet. Oh, Stark found that one. Nice. Oh, and we're not too far from him, either. Sweet. So what I'd like to go is get some trade going. Also, yeah, I'm... <coughs> I love having the option to trade to every city-state, because, uh, more money. <laughs> Again, how can you go wrong with more money? Are we gonna expand? Yes, we are. Thank you, Liberty! Woohoo! Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. That'll be the next time I can choose a thing. Crap. <laughs> yeah. Yahoo! Crapping! More stuff. Ah. <clears throat> <sighs> Now, I picked this to one, yes, this mod I picked because, yes, Markiplier, of course, but because I wanted to see if they would have added more things to it, but it seems like if they had something like doing, like, an option either of making a dude or making a building thing, something to do with Warfstash, because, I mean, that's, like, half of Markiplier, or, uh, no, it's like a third. Because the other third is, like, dark fire. <laughs> but I would like to see, like, war stash things. Like, <clears throat> I don't know. Having war stash, I guess, as, like, a general. But, like, ups your culture somehow. But being a general. I don't know. Yay, we found a settler. That's also another thing about these relics artifacts that you find you can find people there either settlers or workers or other warriors or even better stuff for your warriors that find it fantastic oh. and i haven't gotten far enough to where you've researched everything and then you're just researching future stuff i've never gotten that far because i always either i immediately lose no no it's always i, lo I lost i never got that far because either whoever won the delegates thing, or they just took all my cities, and I... Sad Pam. <laughs> I don't want to lose my cities. I like my cities. But we need to get that happiness up, so get that circus going. Nah, granary sounds better. Am I pronouncing that right? Yeah, whatever. Because uh, deer and wheat will produce more. We want more production, we want more food. I'm so glad that marking moves are cheap, because this would take forever. I also tried to figure out a way to make this go quicker than quick, and <clears throat> there's there's no option for quicker <laughs> than quick. So, boo on that, but hooray, I get another s worker? No, that's not what I wanted, I want another settler. Whatever. Oh no, I do want a worker, because then I can send him over here, I can stop production on that worker, and get that something going. Recording studio, probably, yeah. That would seem better. But yeah, I tried to make this game faster than it should be, but it won't give me the option of quicker. <laughs> so yeah, sorry about that. <clears throat> I mean, I'm not going to waste too much time of you guys just watching me fail at Civ, but, you know. Now, do they look like? No, they don't. That would have been really neat if they just looked like a little army of Markipliers. That'd be great. <laughs> We need an army of Markipliers, because why not? Can't go wrong with that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the meat oh, man. The earth, but not I just... <clears throat> everything Markiplier does, I've watched... I started watching him, I want to say, about three years ago. He's been on for four. And Amnesia Dark Descent was just, like, one of his best recordings, just because of all the smack-talking he does. <laughs> I love his shit talk. It's great. <laughs> That's how I cope with fear when I'm terrified out of my ass. I just talk shit to the game because that's the best way to deal with that, right? Yeah. And like, watching him started recording without a video of himself 
and then moving up to Dead Space, one uh, Dead Space one through three, fantastic. Again, his banter for that game is great. Although I I did catch myself yelling at him to not miss certain things. Not that I I I haven't played Dead Space. Like I got halfway through the first one, but I mm, younger me was chicken shit. Like I'm still kind of a chicken shit now, but I mm mm mm. I, I had to put the sticks down, I dashboarded so fast, uh, done. <laughs> I was like, nope, I am not ready to pee my pants. Next game. <laughs> Let's tone that down a bit. <clears throat> I don't know if me now could handle that better, but once Steam puts that game on a ridiculous sale, then I'll probably go buy it. I'm cheap, by the way, so yeah, there's that. <laughs> but yeah. Watching him go from those things to running so many charities now and doing like random challenge videos or just random videos of him and his friends in general, it's great to see how much he's grown and how much he's grown as a person. Didn't mean to make that sound like questions or anything, <clears throat> but it's just great to see like he puts a lot of work and effort into his videos and it's just amazing to see what he started with and what he has now and eventually I want to get there too but I still have a lot of ropes to learn because I'm doing my own editing I don't know how to make you know at the end of the video they have links to click I, I don't know how to do that I just started figuring out thumbnails I mean I sound so noobish but I mean I'm I'm a noob to this and I'm, I'm trying and I am gonna work better on it I am getting better every time I do one <coughs> It's just now the programs I need cost money, and no, <laughs> I'm gonna do this the cheapest way I can. F that. <laughs> See, we have horses, we have ivory, we have sheep. That's good. Oh, and we have stone. Yeah, stone. Sweet. We need that copper though. <clears throat> they need to hurry up and give me that copper. I mean, my land needs to go ahead and take that copper first before I can just go ahead trudging through it. But you know. <clears throat> I wonder if we'll surpass Tony Stark. Probably not. I'm not paying attention to the score. As long as we're above the other two. Yeah, and I'm kind of rude like that. <laughs> I put myself with somebody else as a team. And then the other two can spend for themselves. <laughs> because, no. I, I, I want to try to win. But, like, it's a 50-50 chance either way. No matter how I set it. Either my people are going to rebel against me. And I'm going to lose, because I'm dealing with that. Or, yeah, I'm just going to lose. <laughs> I'm just going to lose. No, boo. I don't want to lose. <sighs> Yay, more relics. We need, I think I need to look up, I, I need to search up getting a settler soon. Although, I think we're close to getting another point to, yes, I can adopt another policy suite. Maybe I'll get another settler that way. That'd be great. But, ah, oh, that golden age, though. Control. Oh, that's not terrible. Yeah, I need that money, though. <coughs> I'll worry about getting another settler in a little bit. Mm, maybe, maybe not. I'm so indecisive. <laughs> yes. Getting another settler. Where are we going to put your ass? Mmm, probably by the dyes and the deer. Yeah, that looks about right. <clears throat> Yay, more dudes. Wait, no? No, no, not more dudes. Better equipment. Sorry. Instead of little axe hammer things, they have swords? Okay. I mean, it, honestly, the weapons you have is to each their own. <laughs> At this time. Sword, axe, hammer, giant thick bat, you know, whatever. But I do like how you can, if you make enough gold when it comes to upgrading your dudes, it won't matter because you'll have a ton of gold <coughs> if you save up. Because I normally, I don't, unless I'm late, like one of my towns is way behind, then yeah, I'll spend all the gold on that town to catch up on all the researching it needs to do. But I don't really spend gold because the, the way Markiplier fans out, it become big quick like his borders expand pretty quickly quicker than other normal 
quote quote normal civilizations. He, I think Markiplier will get the higher ground in this game, <clears throat> but I will have to end it here, because why not? Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video and would like to see more, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you tomorrow.